Hello and welcome. It's Carnage. I wanted to take some time and talk a little bit about my motivations for doing these reviews, why you might be interested in watching mine or not watching mine as opposed to someone else's. My main interest in these action figures uh, since I started collecting the line at the beginning of the line uh, has been photography. And uh, the G.I. Joe Classified series actually sparked my interest in photography and uh, also in dioramas, building them, buying them, setting up photos with them, uh, as well as my G.I. Joe Classified figures. I don't really collect any other lines, although there are several that I might occasionally pick up something from. Um, there are certainly some diorama lines that... Uh, I favor, and we'll talk about that in some other videos, but uh, I wanted to focus mainly on talking about why I'm doing these reviews. Um, my purpose is to talk about these figures in terms of photography, toy photography. I know that a lot of toy reviewers seemingly begin and end their relationship with a figure when they do their video review, which is typically... I think the same day a lot of these guys get their figures because there's a real rush to be among the first to get a video up there when a figure comes out, particularly if you're lucky enough to get it a bit early. I like to make sure that I've had some time to do a couple of photo sessions with a figure before I do my review. I want to have some photos to post, and uh, I want to literally get my hands on the figure so that I have some things to talk about and uh, so that I have some experience with the figure. While I agree it's cool to get first impressions out of the box, uh, I would rather hear something from someone who's got a bit of experience with the figure. Uh, and again, photography is going to be the main purpose of doing these reviews. So I'm going to be talking about aesthetics uh, and certainly posability because that's very important with photography. Um, and uh, these points of articulation and having so many of them is what makes this photography so much fun. So I hope that this gives you some insight as to why I'm doing these videos. It certainly isn't for money. Uh, it's strictly out of love for this line. And um, I started collecting this line in uh, about 1983. I was born in 1972, so that makes me 51 years old as I'm doing this video. And uh, I did start collecting this line uh, at the beginning, which incidentally was during the pandemic. So I think a lot of us have that pandemic story perhaps in common as what uh, might have brought us to G.I. Joe Classified. I would love to hear from each and every one of you listening to this video as well as your uh, motivations, your reasons for getting involved in G.I. Joe Classified. I hope you will subscribe.